<laughs> I just remembered something about X screensaver. I um... oh, what they should have done. What they should have done is they should have made it Larry the cow from for Gentoo. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so I I went and looked back at some early stuff about Ubuntu because Ubuntu's done some like weird things throughout their history. This is going to tie back into X screensaver. Um, yeah, back in Warty Warthog, um, there were. <laughs> So Mark Shuttleworth had a brilliant idea. It was it was it was really dumb. Um, so Mark Shuttleworth was like, "Hey, so let's include this like tasteful nudity picture as like I think it was going to be the login screen. There was going to be one for the calendar, and the calendar one was going to like change every month." Um, right. It, it got a lot of community back. Like, this was before Warty Warthog came out. This was during, like, the RCs. When it was added, right. people were like, why is this here? Because there was also a bug at the time where if you were upgrading from, like, the previous RC to the new one and you hadn't set a custom wallpaper, which, you know, most people using Ubuntu at that time would be upgrading because, you know, you're using the RC before it officially released. Anyone... Anyone there at that point is, like, very dedicated to what Ubuntu is going to become as a project. Um, right. So if you didn't have a, a wallpaper set, it set the calendar picture as the wallpaper. Um, then a lot of people suddenly saw it. So some kids, some person's teenagers logging onto the desktop to see this new... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and then, <laughs> then the mailing list was just full of comments about this, but... When there was a discussion about removal, which eventually did happen because it wasn't there with, you know, when Woody Warthog came out, well, otherwise actual, everybody yeah, would really remember that. Um, official release, yeah. Mm -mm. Uh, th there was also brought up some stuff about X Screensaver. Now, X Screensaver at the time, I'll find this one because other distros uh, talked about it as well. X Screensaver. Mm -hmm. uh, here we go. I'll send it to you because it's, it's hilarious. Uh, this is the one from the Fedora mailing list or Fedora forums. Um, but it was reported on Gen 2 and reported on... Um, it was reported on a bunch of others as well. Does this one mention it? Ah, oh, here it is. Um, yeah. Much to my surprise, I stumbled across it drawing an erect penis. At the time, there was an option in X Screensaver called Penis. And flaccid uh -huh. penis and erect penis, and it would just draw, it would just draw one on your screen as a screensaver. Right. That is awesome. <laughs> it was, and the, the the best part about it is it was added without any mention in the change log, so it was just suddenly there. So if you had X, there. if you just had X screensaver like set on random, it would yeah. just come up at some point. Um, oh, that's awesome. When that happened, a bunch of distros were like, wait, why is this here? And then everyone just patched it out themselves. I think it was eventually then removed from X Screensaver itself because every other distro removed it anyway. But like, right. there are so many weird things like that back in the early history of, uh, early, of Linux. Early, I'm, you know, the early days of Linux. I, oh my God, I don't even know how to... 